Well, I'll let him tell the stories. I'm not going to ruin them for him. <laughs> Sam Russell, and the other was his sister, Julie, and they're both over in the audience, and I wish they'd stand up, and Pat, who's Sam's wife, is their manager, <laughs> and, and I'd like the three of them to stand up, because no one else in this room was here for the first graders in 1941. <laughs> school, and being a wife of a, of a master at that time was uh, these real heroines. Now, in the 1980s, Penny and I began the Cypher Family New Faculty Trustee Dinner to kick off Country Fair Weekend. We started with just the first year uh, faculty members, expanded it quickly to one to three years, then asked the headmaster to include other members of the Eagle Brook community from an initial year a total of 22 faculty and trustees. The attendance now is over 100. And uh, October 22 will be the 33rd year of the dinner, excluding the two COVID years. Now, the Board of Trustees and management have improved the work and living conditions for Eagle Brook faculty and their families. The objective is, and the objective of our dinner was that faculty should be a career job and be made more and more attractive for people to come and stay at Eagle Brook. Now, Jerry Mayer was the longtime president of the board, and he always referred to Eagle Brook as a national treasure. Now, I believe that the performance of the Eagle community during the pandemic, management, parents, trustees, staff, and support groups, and, and those, I don't know, I don't know their names, that contributed but at all levels, uh, everybody at Eagle Brook endorsed Jerry's vision. And I think today we have a stronger, more useful Eagle Brook future than we had before the pandemic. Now, uh, another thing that Jerry Mayer said was, Eagle Brook doesn't have many problems that can't be resolved with money. So, <laughs> so that's, that's the pitch of the night. <laughs> so happy to be here for the 75th. I never, wasn't really sure I'd ever make it. And uh, the amazing things have been done here in the years that Sam and I have watched the place grow and it's great and I know there's more to come. So thank you for the time. 